<laughs> Hello YouTube. Woo! First leak in the room. Woo! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And it is wet. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And it is wet. I've got holes up there from the solar panels that I that I just recently took off. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. It's a new life for Woo! Me. Um, tomorrow I'm going to be going to do laundry. Maybe I'll bring you guys along. I don't know. <laughs> been... The next day. I'm just sitting here at the laundry mat waiting for my laundry to get done. Talk about this for a while. I thought this may help some people out there. Friends to avoid on the road. This just means in life in general, actually. Now I'm going to warn you. This article is more geared towards women and the issues towards uh, modern women these days. So when I say the word woman, I, I would uh, change that word to people because uh, a lot of times this includes everybody, not just women. That's what it says, right? Before anybody gets all, I'm offended. So leftist movements are funded and dis distributed by government institutions. Most women are pro-BLM, pro-abortion, pro-promiscuity, pro-LGBT, uh, LMNLP, pro-windmill, etc. Women are more likely than men to have pronouns in their bio. Awesome. Disagreeing with the status quo is a dangerous endeavor because it results in ostracism. Fear it. Not fearing the consequences of ostracism is the fundamental criterion for having integrity. Where, and that's the most important part right there. in a group setting and they're agreeing with everybody in the room you know all the time and they don't you know they don't want to offend anybody or anything those are the people that you have to be afraid of those are the people that in my opinion you can never trust <laughs> times <clears throat> I've been the only person in the room that was uh, sticking to my guns on, on one subject or another really nigga the most popular people that I see are actually the most disgusting to me. Things that they don't agree with just because they don't want to upset anybody and they want to look like they have a bunch of friends and stuff like that. Their life has become a popularity contest, right? Dane, it's it's all over. Almost everybody you meet, you know, it's 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 insane. But, these are weak-minded people and people that you can't trust. And I don't know about all of you guys out there, but to me, the most important thing in a friendship is loyalty. I don't look for a friend to be disagreeable with me. I mostly like to hang out with like-minded people. But I watch the people that I'm friends with. I watch what they do. I tend to have people that are that pretty much agree with me on most things. But then I watch them. If they go around, they say one thing to me, and then they go around doing the exact opposite. That's somebody I can't trust. That's somebody that will always stay, you know. Let me put it very simply. If your family circle does indeed join my family circle, they'll form a chain. I can't have a chink in my chain. Hmm. Yeah, okay. I get the metaphor. Not fearing consequences of ostracism is the fundamental criterion for having integrity. Integrity is the ability to stay true to one's values and the truth regardless of social convenience. Most modern women are incurably degenerate and lack integrity, and for this reason are unfit to be good friends. 
better to have fewer friends or no friends than it is to have degenerate ones. Of sticking to your guns on truth, right? Now you don't wanna be arrogant and never be able to learn anything. If somebody makes a point, shows you a fact, go, oh, that's cool. I read I might change my mind. That doesn't make you dumb, that makes you smart, right? But also if everybody in the if everybody's jumping off of a bridge like your parents used to tell you and it doesn't look like a good idea, don't do it. Most people and that's why you can't be around most people. Because you tend to be you tend to turn out to be the person that the people that you hang out with the most. <laughs> It's just a fact of uh, human nature, you know what I mean? Unless you're really strong-willed. Me, personally, I do not care about being ostracized. I've been ostracized from um, groups in the past. And at first it hurt. And then afterwards, I was thinking, oh, that's probably for the best. Avoid or uh, friendships that you may want to avoid. On the, while you're on the road, if they, if a person doesn't carry any truth with them and they can't stick to the truth, then there's nothing to respect.